a boat, for its size is the most powerful craft of float. And the star tugs are the power behind the docks and waterways that make up the big city board. This is Tugs. It was late spring, and thankfully for ten cents and sunshine, their double duties were coming to a close. I had ten cents and sunshine working upriver to help the salvage fleet with all the extra spring work. But little did we know, there was a pirate lurking out in the open water. Now that I'm here, I must find a small dog to do my work for me. <sighs> well. That's the last load for me. Anything else for you, Sunshine? One last load for Mitzville, then I'm done. Okay, I'll catch up with you. Okay, see you soon. Hello? I've arrived with the load. You stupid little switcher. We needed diesel, not gasoline. I will inform your captain and request that you are grounded. Huh. I can't go on another mistake rampage like last year. The captain will sell me off. But Sunshine was too busy worrying to himself. He didn't realize the gigantic tramp steamer headed towards him. Hey, you! Huh? Yeah, you, little tugboat. Oh, uh, hello. Do you need to tow in a port? Slip me into a dock where I can't be seen. I will give you further orders from there. What? Now! Oh, oh, okay. I don't like this place. These docks exploded last year, you know? Let me introduce myself. I'm Congo King, and for the next few weeks, you'll be giving me small samples of goods. But, but, but that's illegal. I don't care. Now, I'll see you tonight. And if you report me to the Coast Guard, I will send out a hitman to sink you. Oh, okay. Sunshine, where have you been? Oh, just delivering a small load to Lucky's. Oh, well, come on. It's getting late. <sighs> I'm tired. Unknown to us, in the middle of the night, Sunshine was not at the Star Dock. He had made his way to Mitzville to find something to please Congo King for the night. Ah, some green engine parts. This will be perfect. Uh, hello? <coughs> Shh, keep it down. Oh, uh, sorry. I brought you something. Good, that's very good. Crane engine parts. So, um, can I? Gotcha. I will see you tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. For sure. <laughs> Where did it go? Where did what go, sir? I had a lot of crane engine parts to fix my crane in the middle of last night. And now, it has disappeared. Oh no, that really is strange. Sunshine, quietly petrified in fear, kept silent during the whole conversation, because he knew that he took the parts. The next night, Sunshine had smuggled a barrel of root beer for Congo King. Perfect. Root beer. This is going to make me a lot of moolah. 
Yeah, yeah, sure. I'm glad I found you. You're very trustworthy. F thanks. Uh, no scram. Aye, uh, sir. So. Honestly, Chief, I have no idea where the missing rupee is. Right. I'll check in with you tomorrow. Good morning, uh, Ten Cent. Morning, Sunshine. Did you hear what happened last night? A barrel of root beer was stolen. Yeah, yeah, ten cents. Sunshine, are you just not phased by this at all? No, no, I am a ten cents. Sunshine, do you know where the root beer is? What? No, no, ten cents. I have no idea where it is. I think he does know where it is. I'll check in with him tonight. As per usual, Sunshine had snuck away from the star lock in search of a load of goods for Congo King. But what he didn't know was Tencent was waiting at the mouth of the harbor, prepared to spring a trap for him. I hope this is the last bit of goods that he wants. I think that Tencent has rumpled me. Hey, do, Sunshine! What the Tencent? I've got you, you can't escape! I'd never think I'd have to turn my friend into the authorities. Oh no, ten cents, please let go of me, I'm serious. No, piracy is illegal. Ten cents, please let go of me. I'd never think Sunshine, one of the best switches in Big City Port, would ever be a pirate. Ten cents, let go of me. Oh, uh, okay, Sunshine, off you go. Oh dear. <laughs> Mm, yes, cement. You always pick up the best goods, Moonlight. Um, actually, uh, it's sunshine, so yeah, whatever. You know what? Why don't you come back to African box with me? There, you'll be very... No, piracy is illegal. I'd never think sunshine, one of the best switches in big city port, would ever be a pirate. And as long as you steal enough goods, you will get paid grand every single week. And... I'll never be like you. You're a filthy criminal pirate. Remember what I said would happen if you did this. Um, no? Well, maybe this will jog your memory. <laughs> What, what, what are you doing? The next morning, as the rest of the tugs set out for their daily jobs, Ten Cents decided to stay behind at the dock. Warrior, daily garbage detail for you. Aye, aye, sir. I'll do me best, sir. So, Ten Cents, what is this thing that you were daring to inform me about? Well, sir, it's about Sunshine. He doesn't seem... right. Well, what do you mean? Well, he's been very jittery recently, not talking at all, and I had a confrontation with him last night, and he seemed very distressed about something. And seeing as he's not here this morning, I think things are terribly wrong. Hmm, I see, Ten Cents. I'm giving you special permission this morning. You must go out and search for sunshine. Immediately. Get on with it. Oh, yes, Captain Star, sir. Aye, aye, sir. At once, sir. Godspeed, Ten Cents. Godspeed. Oh, Sunshine. How did this happen? Aw, oh, Ten Cents. The truth is I've been in denial this whole time. Well, come on. Own up. What is it? Well, the truth is, I've been being held a hostage by a trap steamer pirate named Congo King, and for the past week I've been stealing goods from all around this part of the coast. Oh no. Well, first let me get you off those rocks, and then we'll bite back and turn him into the authorities. Yeah, yeah, you're right, Ten Cents. Okay, you don't look like you're wedged in there too firmly, and you're not very damaged. I bet I could tow you off those rocks. K 
Come on, let's get back to African dogs. I'm ready to start making cuckoo bucks off of all of this junk. But what he didn't realize was that Tencent and Sunshine were ready at the channel mouth, preparing to spring a trap for him. <laughs> Charge! Charge! Oi, what's this all about? You're under arrest, Congo King. Oi, who said that? What? A switcher tug? Ah, <laughs> what weakling. Oi, what you say about switcher tugs? Oi, quit bumping me, midget. Call me small again and I'll sink you. Oh, we're gonna take you into custody right where you belong. What? No, nobody can. I'm the great Congo King. Watch me. Boy, come back here! Alright, what's this? Uh, switchers? What the? Ah! Sorry, zip. <laughs> Those silly switches wouldn't catch me even if I was in the right top. Oh, oh no! Oh, hell. Hey Sunshine, isn't it funny how Congo King made you run aground in the estuary, and now we've made him run aground on the Demda Rocks? <laughs> Ahoy there, help to Tencent, Sunshine, why is that tramp steamer moored up on Demda Rocks? Because he's a backstabbing criminal. Oh, is he now? Yeah. He is. This tramp steamer has held Sunshine hostage since Monday, and has made him steal goods all the way from Snuggle Bay up to Uptown Upriver. Hmm, I see. Well, you two go fetch Little Ditcher, and then take him to the Coast Guard dock where we'll run him in for questioning. Aye aye, Coast Guard. Congo King was taken in for questioning, and by that noon, he was sentenced to be nuked in the bay up the coast. Right, come on, you stupid old piece of scrap metal. Hey, watch it. Would you shut your trap, my darling? You know, I'm really glad to see him go. Sunshine, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, ten cents. Just a bit stressed. And, uh, I'm sorry for not telling you about this sooner. Oh, don't worry, Sunshine. Your life is on the line. Now, come on. Let's enjoy our afternoon while we still can.